In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to save a specific portion of your AutoCADI drawing to a separate file. This skill can be incredibly useful if you're looking to isolate part of your design for sharing, further editing, or archiving. Let's dive straight into the process. First, we need to define the area of the drawing that you want to save separately. To do this, draw an object around the specific portion of your design. You could use any closed shape that's convenient, such as a rectangle or a circle, depending on the complexity and layout of your drawing. This creates a boundary marker for the part of your design you wish to retain. A tip here is to zoom in as much as possible and ensure precision when you're drawing this enclosing shape since it will determine exactly what part of your drawing gets saved. Now that you've created your outline, you'll want to remove all elements outside of it. This is where the Xtrim command in AutoCAD becomes useful. By using Xtrim, you can quickly trim away everything outside your designated boundaries. Simply type in the command Xtrim, then select the boundary object you've drawn. The software will prompt you to confirm the trimming action, ensuring that all exterior parts are deleted. Once this process is complete, you should be left with only the portion of the drawing that you want to save. With your drawing now reduced to the section you're interested in, it's time to utilize the right block command, which is an efficient way to save a specific portion of your drawing as its own file. To do this, enter the letter W into the command line and press Enter. This is a shortcut to activate the right block command. When prompted, you'll need to select the area within your boundary. You can click and drag to manually select the entities, or alternatively, use the selection function to capture everything within your defined space. Afterwards, the software will ask you to choose a file name and a destination for your block file. Here, it's a good practice to provide a descriptive file name that reflects the content or purpose of this particular portion of your drawing. Also, make sure to save the file in a location that's easy for you to remember, or follow your organization's file management protocols to ensure that others can find it easily if needed. And with that, you have successfully saved a specific portion of your AutoCAD drawing into a separate file. This allows you to work more efficiently, sharing only the necessary parts of your design. Make use of these steps whenever you need a clean cut of your work. Thank you for watching and happy designing.